Hey guys, in this video I will show you how to turn this into this. As I mentioned in my previous tutorials, for me personally drums are the most important element, so I always do my best to make it sound as good as possible. So in this video I will show you my way of processing drums to make it fatter, bigger and wider and without having extra dbs on my master channel. So I have this basic drum loop and in the first place I want to select all these drums and put into the one group. Now let's take loop compressor and make slow attack, fast release time, set ratio to 2 and I'm gonna pull down this threshold knob until I see this needle barely moving giving me from 1 to 2 dB of gain reduction. And then let's add some saturation to glue these drums even more. Ok, it's time to move on to parallel processing. So the parallel processing is basically the process of blending wet audio to the dry one, giving some energy and perceived loudness. So to do that I need to create return track, let's call it fatness, and activate send button. And then I'm gonna saturate it heavily to simply destroy my drums. Yeah, usually producers use compressor for this, but I'm gonna do this my way because there is no rules in making music. Let's take EQ, select the high pass filter and move it across the spectrum until we reach the area where the only thing we are able to hear is our percussion and head sounds. And lastly, let's mix these destroyed drums with original ones. Now let's make these drums a little bit brighter and wider by creating another return track.
Now he wants to compress it heavily. And this time I'm gonna use Erosion. Let's add another one. Let's take EQ again and cut almost all frequencies, leaving the highest ones only. Another EQ. And let's boost a bit in this area. Let's blend it with our drums. And now I'm gonna make one more return track. Get back to the one I created before and copy all plugins in here. And then drop those in the track I just made. So now I have two similar return tracks. And I'm going to pan first track to the left and second one to the right. Let's take a listen. It's so loud. So once again, here's before. And after. So now you can clearly hear how we improve these drums. It sounds way louder and heavier. And 
Let's look at the meter, we peaking at the same level as it was before. And that's it. Hope you find this video useful. If you do so, please subscribe to the channel. And I see you soon. Bye bye.